Come sir, good morning and welcome to your general reading. My name's Clive, you're watching Emirates Tower. It's a great pleasure to be here. Um, the universe has given me a gift of insight. Okay, I am very spiritual. And you know, it's, it's fantastic being able to be here to help you on your life's journey. You're all very, very welcome. New viewers, cross watchers, etc. All right, the only thing I would say is please take the bits that resonate, leave the rest. Do not try to make it fit. Okay, so let's see what's going on with you. Let's see what's going on with you. You have nine of wands, eight, nine of pentacles. Wow. Straight off the bat, there's a lot of fear here, a lot of inhibitions, there's a lot of challenges. You have the Eight of Wands, Four of Wands, the Chariot, very determined, Three of Cups, Major Decisions, Major, Major Decisions, Ten of Wands, Sun Card, wow, you're determined, very determined to see this through, Ace of Swords, Six of Pentacles, Major Decisions, dealing with two situations, Three of Wands, Two of Wands, wow, Actually, planning, overcoming caution, overcoming fear. Four of Cups, world card, the heart wants what the heart wants, whether this person's at a distance or close by. You have the Justice card, you have the Ace of Pentacles, some of you could be dealing with legal issues. You have the Hermit, you have the Seven of Swords. Well, there's a lot of conflict around this. What I'm getting straight off the bat is for a lot of you, there is conflicting situations, okay? Now, whether you're dealing with two people trying to make a choice between these two people, whether this person's married or children or involved with somebody else, the ex, etc. there's this kind of third party energy. For some of you, there could be a parental influence, all right, but I'm kind of getting, there is some legal issues either you or the person you're dealing with need to see through. All right, now for some of you, you could be going through a divorce or a separation. Okay, you've found somebody new, there is a new path opening up for you and you want to follow this. And you're very, very determined. I'm kind of getting you've given way in the past. Okay, I've been convinced differently somebody's promised changes it's never happened all right but there's there's now someone new or something new a very new nice offer there's, you've been happy for a long while for some of you this could have been going back a decade or more okay but the the universe kind of doesn't see time the way we see it it just sees balance coming in it sees karmic lessons and hopefully people learn through life learn through experience and possibly, hopefully, don't make the same mistakes over and over again. What I'm getting here is that some of you will be relocating, at the very least, taking a break. All right, you are very, very determined in your new path that's opening up. You're very determined there's an opportunity here that you want to make good use of. You feel this at the, perhaps is a blue moon opportunity. You don't want to miss it. And despite separations, which, let's face it, in this world of technology, you know, it depends on your perspective on how you base a connection. Now, for some people, the connection has to be physically around you. And with soulmates, twin flames, etc., that it's a question of perhaps changing your perspective to accept that connection on a spiritual level rather than a physical level. I mean, I have a soulmate. They, you know, they live in a distant land. I don't speak to them from one end of the year to the next, but I'm aware of that connection. But I've accepted that that's a spiritual connection rather than a physical one. Hmm. Speaking of the world, with the world card on top of the four of cups, there is perhaps a distance relationship here for some of you. But what I'm getting is you've come full circle on yourself. Okay, and there's a, there's a particular cycle in your life that's come round 
and it literally is what goes around comes around you you're back to square one hopefully you've learnt many lessons and karmic lessons from the past and you're using pretty good judgment your your temperament is much more even now than what it was before i'm kind of getting there was a a lot of extremes in your past but going back as three years ago i'm kind of getting that for some of you there is this determination to stop dragging the past with you hmm. some of you are perhaps feeling pressurized there is particular one connection you know there's a lot of complicated things involved for some of you distance work etc a lot of distractions been getting in the way i'm kind of getting you there's a determination here to move away from that okay and i'm getting here pretty much that relationships most any a lot of relationships you can expect to improve okay and it's it's basically because your attitude towards them is less extreme now there is perhaps somebody here whether this is in a career move or whether this is in a personal issue like moving home or whatever, there's there's this question of you you perhaps feel you're being pushed. Okay, I'm kind of getting that you are slowing it down, but what I am getting is there's finally movement after a lot of holding back. Hmm. Now, if there's been somebody that hasn't been in your life for a while, physically, I'm, I'm seeing communication coming in, okay, and the chance to get together. I'm picking up kind of a, a meeting here between you and somebody. And also what I'm getting is that uh, there's split loyalties at the moment, all right. But this decision rests with you. You're the one in control. Hmm. Page of Wands, good news coming in. Now, even if this is in regards to selling or buying a house, children, whatever, I'm kind of getting good news coming in. Now, for one of you, I'm getting this is a, this is a thing with a child about further education, getting into a university and traveling. But this university is far away. I'm getting that's going to be very successful. Mm -hmm. Going forward over the next few years with applications, the child is very intelligent, very inquisitive. That's just for one of you. Okay. But I'm seeing for a lot of you travel in distant lands, even if this is only temporary. Yeah. Eight of Pentacles, Eight of Wands. Well, what I'm getting here is a bit of a tower moment because that's two eights to 16, 16 in the majors with a bit of numerology as I use sometimes. That's that's the tower. So there's there's the uh, irrev irrevocable change going on here. Okay, nothing's ever going to be the same again. And a lot of it is due to your your attitude towards life. I mean, there was a partial success here, but your determination to just keep going, facing ad adversity, okay, is partially bringing you the success. Now, in whatever area of life, you're perhaps gaining more attention than you actually want at the moment, but you are gaining attention. Hmm. I'm picking up here for one of you with a profession, notoriety. Now, whether that's acting or performing in the arts, you know, musician, orchestra, whatever. I'm, I'm picking up notoriety and finally getting recognition. Good news coming in. But it's steady as she goes. Okay. You've been holding back a lot. But now I'm getting that there is progress. There has been somebody coming towards you very, very slowly. Perhaps because of issues therein. Hold ups, delays, divorces, work, distance, whatever. But what I'm getting here is a good solid offer coming your way. This person is genuine, they do want to make a go of it. But they want reciprocity. In your decisions, it's a question of are you prepared to let anybody coerce you 
talk you into something. I'm getting here whatever this is, you know, whatever you're transitioning from to, okay, it's a question of prioritising and putting one thing to rest, clearing up, decluttering energies before moving on. So patience is the key. I'm getting some impatience here for some of you. But as I say, there will perhaps be somebody try and dissuade you from doing what you're going to do. We've got the Page of Cups here. It's being open to change. Because change is coming in. It's kind of being prepared for anything, actually. Because things are going to change in ways that perhaps you ne never envisaged. Mm. Four of Swords. Yep. Yeah. So I've got Four of Swords on top of Four of Cups in the World Card. Yeah. That's change. That's also the strength card in the majors. This is strength, determination and willpower. It's, yeah. Major life changes. Four of pentacles now. So if you want to put them three fours together, that's 12. That's the hangman. Okay. Taking the consequences for your actions. Making a decision. Letting go. Following through. And being prepared to take the consequences for your actions. It's also about change of perspective, which is what I was talking about earlier. Okay. Becoming self-aware. The Empress. All right. Now, as I say, there could be a parental influence in this. <coughs> for, for, you, for some of you, there is definitely children involved. Okay. Whether this is on your side of the person you're dealing with. And for some of you, there's legal issues, divorce here, and are coming back together with somebody that you really want to be with. All right, there's a lot of change here, but what I'm getting majorly, there is a lot of real determination here. But it's not without its problems. Okay. In fact, some of these problems may weigh you down heavily. Okay. It's, it all depends on how much inner strength you've got. To see, to, to see through what you're starting. This, in effect, it's all about taking the consequences for your actions. Because there will be consequences, both good and bad. I'm getting for a lot of you, the, the good consequences will outweigh the bad. And once you're over this hurdle, there will be kind of not stopping you. Once you've sorted all this out, and yes, it could take time. Okay. For some of you, up to two years and... I can hear you now. Oh, two years. Mm. There's, um, you know, it's there's there's a huge karmic lesson here, and one which you'll never forget. I know that sounds a bit callous, but you know, it's these changes are, is are good. But with all this pentacle energy here, it is going to be slow moving. Okay, but with strength, determination, tenacity, continuity, you will get your victory. I can hear some of you saying to yourself, well, is this really worth fighting for? Only you can answer that question. Thanks very much for watching.